Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I'll show you how to install a Sega Dreamcast emulator to your Windows 7, 8 or 10 PC and play Sega Dreamcast ISO games. So all of the links are in the description. The first link will bring you to the Demo emulator. What you want to do, you just want to click download and then install the latest version. So once you've downloaded the latest version of Dmule, you want to go over to this Emu Paradise page. This is where you will get the BIOS for your Dreamcast emulator. Once that's downloaded, you now want to find a game or some games for the emulator. So you want to get those off um, Emu Paradise as well. You can pretty much just get any game you want really. Um, the basic game is Marvel vs Capcom 2, so that's the one I'm going to get. And keep note, when you install this game, you want to get the GDI version. So once you've got the three things downloaded, the emulator itself, the BIOS and the game, the first thing you want to do is just drag the emulator out to your desktop or documents, wherever you want to store it. Then all you want to do is extract the zip file, so I'm going to use WinWAR, so just right click and then extract here. Once it's finished extracting, open up the zip file and you will want to create a new folder and call it ROMs. Now head over back to your downloads folder, find the Dreamcast BIOS, go ahead and rename it and you want to call it DC. So this is going to be called DC.zip. Then you just want to drag the DC.zip file into your ROMs folder. Next you want to just go ahead and launch the Dmule emulator, so just double click on the exe file. It's going to tell you to configure it first. There isn't really much you have to do here. All I would recommend doing is just changing the GDROM plugin to GDR image. Then just click OK and the emulator will start up. Then you want to go to config and video. From here you can change the uh, window resolution to whatever you want. Um, I'm just doing it for this video so I'm just going to leave it as the basic one. But you can just press OK. You can also configure um, controls. So you can configure your keyboard which I'm going to be using. Or you can plug in a PlayStation or Xbox controller. So once you've got those things set up, what you want to do is you want to get your games ready. So head over to your downloads folder and you want to go onto your game and do extract to. Once the game's finished extracting, you want to head over back to your emulators um, folder. Then you just want to drag across your game to the ROMs folder. Once your games are in the ROMs folder, you can go ahead and just launch the Dreamcast emulator again. From here you want to go to Configure, GD ROM, and this is where you want to choose the game that you're currently playing. So you want to click Select, then you want to navigate to the Dmule file folder, then go to the ROMs folder, find your game and just click Open on the file. Then you just want to click OK. And now that should be it. Go to File, Run Dreamcast, and hopefully your game should start playing. So 
so as you can see mine loads up fine um, the computer I, I was doing this video on is actually really bad it's sort of like an old computer but even on this I was actually still able to run it which is kind of impressive So that's pretty much it for this video, if you guys enjoyed make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one.